all the way over there to where she's gonna be. Look at her scratching her hair. She's scratching her hair. La 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 Hold on. That Cadillac just jumped that curb. Oh. Are we good? Yeah, we're safe. Okay. Right. So joining me today is my best friend, Mr. Bryant. Should I say your last name? Give me a code name. I want a code name. I've always wanted a code name. Brian Philip Scotchkins. Philip Scotchkins? Brian Philip Scotchkins is my best friend and we are on an adventure today. Brian called me the other day and was like, hey, what are you doing for your vlog? Today. And I was like, uh, I don't know yet. He's like, would you like to come with me to save a baby deer? A baby deer. A baby deer by the name of Darla. Darla. And guess who named Darla? God. He's a pretty cool guy. Yeah, he's all right. It's the guy sitting next to me, Mr. Brian Falafel Schnappelips. Falafel Schnappelips. Falafel Schnappelips. I love it. <laughs> but right now, we are taking an hour drive. An hour Drive Our drive to Raleigh to go pick up this Darla character who I haven't met yet, so I'm not sure if I like her or not. Uh, we're taking the little baby deer to a rehabilitator who's gonna take her and feed her and grow her into a big, nice, healthy deer and let her back out into the wild and so she can be a wild deer like all the other deer. A deer named Darla. The deer named Darla. Darla won't be around. We're just taking Darla to the rehabilitator. Because yeah. you can't own a deer, children. You can't own a deer. Deer aren't pets. Deer are meant to be in the wild. They're cute and cuddly. And then they live in the woods. And that's or what in your bathroom. Do. They can live in your bathroom. Yes, they can live. If you have a big enough bathroom, they can definitely yeah. live in your bathroom. Yeah. It's okay. 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 So we just picked up Darla. Darla. Darla the deer. Do you want to see Darla? Darla? little deer ever. Darla, Darla, Darla. Unfortunately, Darla can't ride without a crate. And she's kind of shy. Hey, Darla. Say hi to the camera, Darla. Oh, she's so cute. But now we are on our way to Greensboro. G Boro. Greensboro, where we are gonna be taking Darla to a rehabilitation center for deers. Yep. Just for deers? Well, uh, this lady specifically does deer. This lady specifically does deers. And we're gonna be going there and taking this new little baby. We're taking this cute little guy. Girl. 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 <laughs> So before we take Darla, the deer, back to rehabilitation, we are actually going to be taking a little pit stop. Pit stop, but shh. A little pit stop that we have to keep secret. Because I don't know if I'm supposed to. We're not supposed to. We're not sure we're supposed to do this. But it's for a good cause. Uh, Brian's mom recently had a lot of surgery done to where she is bedridden. And, but we thought that maybe Darla, the deer, has some healing abilities and would be able to help his mom cheer up a little bit. Therapy deer. She's gonna be cute dove. She's gonna be huh. really cute. You guys you haven't get, even seen her. Cute, cute dove. Outside she's a the dove. crate. Cause she's a doe. Oh, I get it. It's a mm. joke. You made a joke, guys. She's cute dove. If you think it was funny, let me know in the comments below. Got the Brian's mom's house, and Brian's getting Darla out right now. Darla. She's the cutest. Meet Darla, guys. This is Darla. Oh, it's okay. Mama. Darla, you want to say hi to the camera? Just got done bringing Darla the deer over to Brian's mom to make her feel better. I think it worked. 
Yep, I think she feels a lot better now. She was smiling and hopping around. <laughs> well, she wasn't really hopping around. But well, she was She moving. might be hopping around soon though now. She might be now soon. She was moving around a lot, so that's good. And Darla, I think she's just taking a nap now. See how Darla's doing? Uh -huh. Darla, you're used to sitting down now. You did a good thing today, Darla. Don't you think so? You healed mommy. You healed Brian's mom, Darla. Well, we got ourselves about an hour. About an We're hour. We're gonna have to say bye to Darla. She's going to rehab. Yep, she's got a problem. She's got a problem. She's addicted to drugs and drinking. That she's is bad, com so she's completely wrong. I'm just kidding, she's not addicted to drugs. She's just getting rehabbed uh, to be brought back into normal deer status so she can survive in the wild on her own and not have to worry about things and be a big girl doe. When we, when people find little deer like that, we tell them, leave the deer there because mama deer will leave their little deer somewhere they think is safe while they go out and get food and do their little deer things during the day. Of course. And they come back and yep. they take care of little baby deers. Yep. Um, so we tell people not to take a deer unless it's been abandoned for over 24 hours or either you know the mother's something's happened to the mother unfortunate we told these people to leave this little deer for 24 hours to make sure that the mama deer wasn't around anymore and so 24 hours later they gave us a call back and said they went out in the yard and little darla there walked up to them and tried to nurse on their little dog that she was so hungry so they brought her into us and we fed her and got her nice and happy taught her a few little deer things and now we're taking her to a rehabilitator where she can teach her the rest of deer life and release, release her back into the wild where she can have little deer. And this is the story of Darla the deer. Darla the deer. Darla the deer. Hey, so we are almost there. Like, from the sounds of it, really, really close. So, unfortunately, we're gonna have to be saying goodbye to Darla. <laughs> The She's deer. Going to her Turn right onto aerial farm. Yeah, but rehabilitator. From, it's gonna take care of her. Mm -hmm. From the looks of it, she's gonna have a lot of space. Yeah, she's gonna grow her good. She's got a lot of, lot of room out here. There was even a lake down the road. It was a really nice lake. I wanted to jump in it, but I know we had to get Darla back, so I guess I'll just have to do that later. Yeah, I'm gonna miss her. She's really cute. <sighs> I'm Darla. Let's see you, Darla. Darla, you wanna say bye? I'm gonna say bye, Darla. No, Darla, don't be. So we just dropped off Darla. Dropped her off. There's her house. There's the house back there. Back yonder. She's gonna be growed up to a beautiful baby deer. And we had to say goodbye. <laughs> gonna miss her. But we won't forget her. We won't forget her. She's a sweet little dog. That sounded like a good adventure for today. That was fun. Now we gotta drive all the way back to Dirty D. Oh, I forgot about that part. Yep. Yeah. Long drive. Oh, crap. <laughs>